Hi everyone, it's Alicia with the Doherty Dozen and this is my weekly grocery haul for my family of 13. But first, coffee. Here's this week's dinner menu that we made together as a family. Around the World Night has moved back to Mondays and we will be doing Libya. From there, I expand to add in what we'll have for breakfast and lunch every day to make our grocery list separated out by areas of the store. I'm at Wegmans today. I got my bags. I got my coffee. It's 6.17 a.m. I always play this internal game of like how fast I can grocery shop. start over with the non-perishable stuff. I still have to get to Target for this stuff, so ignore that right now. Cart one. I love the Buffalo Bills section. It makes me happy. Okay, I have to get laundry detergent. I need large dinner plates. Do they have them? Yes, they do. Okay, I'm only seeing like the Wegmans brand in the family pack. That's what we'll get. Okay, we got Clark Swipes. Oops. Tish soap. Large plates. Oh, I need tish tish. Okay. I walked right past them. Oh. And more bleach spray. Oh my gosh, how cute are those tissues? I gotta get one for the bathroom. Paper towels. No, that is toilet paper. Oh my gosh. I need to drink more coffee. I mean, they look exactly the same, right? Toilet paper. Paper towels. All right, I'm gonna put the tissues there, so I'm gonna put the paper towels here. Gallon bags. And that is it for this aisle. Okay, let's move on to boxed and canned. By the way, I found the parchment paper last week, so that is why I did not buy that. I love my mother-in-law. Sometimes Nana puts things away in a different spot than I put things away, and then I can't find it, and then I think I don't have any, but I found it. I was say, don't, don't bite the hand that feeds you. She wants to clean up my kitchen. I'm not gonna say a thing. Clean it up. That's fine with me. Put it where you want it. All right, around the world night, we are doing Libya. Let me just peek at the international aisle and see if there's any snacks. It's like, it's like a ghost town. Here. Right, this is the aisle I can waste way too much time. I am not seeing anything and I just remembered around the world night moved back to Mondays. So now I don't have time to like order anything on Amazon. I'm gonna have to plan ahead. Okay. Get tortillas. Over to spices, I need cinnamon sticks. Steak seasoning. 
Okay, I gotta get the Nutella snacks. Alright, four packs of four. asked for Oreos. Okay, they didn't have the um, popcorn. So I'm gonna look at Target for that when I go later. I'm gonna get some Doritos. Let me get some of these for while we watch the bills going tomorrow. Salsa and queso. I need oranges and peas in this aisle. Okay, sometimes they have like a family pack. Uh, not today. Okay. Croutons for the salad bar this week. What's this? Okay, we got garlic, Caesar, ooh, sesame, cheese, and garlic. Okay, I'm not finding couscous. So, we're gonna what, cheat it a little bit and get this. Need more pasta sauce. I forgot to get chickpeas when I was in this aisle. AKA garbanzo beans. And could be cash. Okay, go ahead. We got sauce, corn beef, oranges, egg noodles, couscous chickpeas, chicken stock, and peas. I decided I'm gonna get the candy when I go to Target. And we got the tortillas. I am gonna go get the produce. Getting a little bit at a time lately. Kids are not in a banana phase again. They go back and forth. All right, let's go get the lettuce. I like to get the shredded lettuce for Taco Tuesday. Salad mix to go with pasta night. of that. Oh, onions. I got the onions. I'm all out. And then I'm going to get pomegranate juice for a recipe. Where is like the big bag of onions? I think it's over there. Although those are really tiny. Hmm. Maybe I'll get these. These look better. There's 
measuring at this, but these are so tiny that like I'd have to use a zillion of them for one recipe. I've got a triple or a quadruple every recipe that I'm doing. I've got any of these and I'm gonna get some bags to put them in because I hate how the skin gets everywhere. Okay, I only needed one bag. I'm sure I'll use this for something else. Some peppers. like that already for lunches and simplifies my life, but they don't today. So that'll have to be the family tag. Okay, let's see where we're at. We got carrots, we got celery, we got salad. Um, these are in the middle of the produce section. We got bell peppers, onions, and cilantro. I'm gonna get a potato for a recipe for around the world night. This might be the last week our garden will produce tomatoes. It was a good run of not buying tomatoes. And cucumbers, there's still a ton of cucumbers. We gotta go pick those up. I need pears for the Heavenly Harvest pork I'm making on Thursday crack that night. Get some apples. Okay. Hey, smell that 
Christmas contents, oranges, watermelon. I just gotta get berries. No, these are like already not good. This one's not bad. over here. Yes, they have two strawberry sections. Maybe it's in my mind, but I feel like these ones are usually better. That. And this. favorite of theirs. So we'll see. They might not eat them, but that's okay. I'll eat them if they don't. There's no blueberries today? There are no blueberries today. Well, that's weird. Alright, um, do we think we can fit the bread on? So, yeah, I think we can. Could this be a three car trip? Another Bills section. Okay, in the fall, we usually have football games on Friday, so we don't really have time to do Make Your Own Pizza Night. However, this week's football game is on Thursday night, so we do have time to do Make Your Own Pizza Night Friday. We went through an insane amount of bread last week. We went through eight loaves of bread. We have reached a football season where most days we end up with extra football players in our house and they're all hungry and they all make sandwiches. No, they're not sick of sandwiches. Frequently asked question in my videos. So, I'm going to start with five loaves of bread. We'll see how far that gets us in the week. Let's see what they have for pizza crust today. Alright, my kids really like the Kantos one and I'm not seeing those, so I might get those later in the week. Or maybe that will be a random thing Target has. Sometimes they have random things like that. Um, okay. I need Hawaiian rolls. Wrong. Some bagels. Let's go get one more car. Cart three. I have to get a couple sympathy cards. We are very close with a lot of our biological families of our kids that we've adopted and um, when they have a death in the family, it's a, it's like we had a death in the family, right? Because we're like all family. Anyways, I want to send James's mom and biological sister sympathy cards. Um, he recently lost his uncle. He was able to go spend time with his mom and sister and aunt yesterday. Um, and had lunch with them, so that was nice. Okay the potato and then we got the bread. I'm going to see if Target has Hawaiian rolls. Bread. And then what else did I say? Oh, the pizza crust. I didn't even write that down. So I usually just like save this and put it in my purse and then when I get to the next shopping haul, I'll get the stuff I didn't get here. Okay, let's go get the dairy products. Creamer. Oh, they're not blasting music in the dairy section today. More eggs.
chickens recently passed away. Uh, sweet Chicoletta. set on chocolate almond milk. Sandwich meat. sausage biscuits and gravy last week and then they ended up using the leftovers and making more biscuits the next day so now I have to get biscuits because we're all out. I'm gonna stock up because I'm making monkey bread this week and I like to just have some in the fridge. Okay, I got ground beef, 
we're going to get steak or loin. And we're done. We've been wanting to have a salad bar, so we worked that into grill night on Wednesday. We'll grill up some sirloins, cut it up, have a salad bar. Have seen if they have a family pack? Yes, they do. Family pack, sirloin, five, four and a half pounds. Two of those. double-double recipes for our family and then I double-double-double double recipes whenever we have pork loin because we repurpose the leftovers into another meal. So like this will be for the, so what is this, 10 pounds for the Heavenly Harvest pork loin on Thursday and then we're going to repurpose and have leftovers for pulled pork for lunch on Saturday. So I'm going to get 17 pounds of pork loin. Now I'm going to put it all in bags. I'm all checked out and I'm coming out a different door than I went in so I wanted to show you this adorable little entryway and they got all these pumpkins over there sometimes they have okay they don't have it up yet they put up like this giant pumpkin okay so they bring the carts out the side door and I'm gonna go drive over and load it in there's my giant fan I forgot I parked over here Right, we are loaded in. That's like a mini haul for me. I know that seems insane. All right, I'll show you how it's loaded in and I'll show you the receipt when we get home and then we'll put it all away real quick. It is a dreary day here, but we are going to the local amusement park because we didn't get to it all summer. 
and today's like the last day that they're open so i'm like we're going i don't care if it's raining we're going it should hold off i think it's just gonna sprinkle this morning and then and then it will just be cloudy but not raining which will maybe work out good maybe other people won't go but that's probably not true because everyone else is probably doing the exact same thing I'm doing and going on the last day that they're open. That is the way our summer went. It flew by. We'll quickly turn from summer activities to fall activities. to like figure out my week if I don't get to around the world night tomorrow because of Jordan's surgery then I'll just put this stuff in the freezer and do it next week he is a kid who like bounces right back kids are funny like that it's just a minor minor um, dental surgery for his braces like he has to get brackets put up in his gums and he's having two teeth extracted He's a kid who bounces right back. However, like knock on wood, this could be the one time I'm like, oh, we're fine. He bounces right back and he doesn't. So that's why I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna just grab popsicles real quick. And if all else fails, around the world night gets moved to next week. And we just order pizza for the rest of the kids for dinner if Jordan Jordan is also uh, one of my, we did attachment parenting with our children, which is amazing. But now that they're grown children, you realize you don't unattach them. They're still very attached. So like, he will probably need me to just cuddle and sit and snuggle with him all day. So that's Jordan when he's feeling down. So if that's the case, then we'll just order pizza. Or he could bounce right back and be running laps around the house. Who knows? You never know with kids. It's a mystery until the day it happens. Always gotta have a backup plan. At least we don't have a football game tomorrow or a cross country race tomorrow. So that's good. to-do list and put it on my regular to-do list. What else? Okay, so the Thursday game is, or the football game is Thursday night. Patrick's cross-country race is Tuesday. However, some of us have an event Tuesday night. So Tuesday is going to be a divide and conquer night. Zoe was supposed to start back to horseback riding last week. She broke her wrist this summer. She fell off a horse, had a cast all summer. Was finally supposed to start back to horseback riding. She was so excited. The day came, it was an hour before her first lesson back and it got canceled because of the heat index being too high. It was insanely hot in New York last week, like 95 degrees. So she was bummed about that. She should have her first horseback riding lesson this week. And then Bree didn't have horseback riding last week. They do a break week in between sessions. So she's back to horseback riding this week. Harley keeps wanting to do horseback riding, but 
they haven't been able to fit her back in the schedule so i'm gonna check out a different barn i think um because she's been asking she does start dance this week though ballet and tap oh zoe did start back to violin though she's had two violin lessons this week that went well even though i have all the kids in school i not had a day with no kids oh <laughs> uh, that is yeah the girls had their doctor's appointments thursday and then jordan's gonna be home i don't know how long he'll be home i mean probably at least two days i would think he'll be home surgery day and the day after to recover Let's see how he's feeling problem when you get teeth pulled like that is you can't like be jumping and running around because it's gotta like the socket has to heal. So I might keep him home from school a couple days just so I can make sure he's not like because he's got a lot of energy. Make sure he's not like running around the gymnasium. Okay, we're home. It is 8.29. All right, my kids are like still asleep or just waking up. So I'm gonna get this banana bread in the oven real quick and then bring in the groceries. So this takes about 45 minutes. Harley's awake. Harley just woke up. Sleep good? Kids are tired from their first week back to school. It's not going to taste yummy, but you can. You can try it. Banana bread batter is not super sweet like cookie dough batter. It's kind of bland and bitter. But you can try it. Hold on. There you go. You want to try a finger ball? Uh, I would have normally used four bananas, but all I had was three. Mm. 
also going to get the pasta boiling so I can have the stuffed shells already made for when we get home later. And let me show you my the receipt before I forget. This is our garage where we store most of our food, pantry shelves, four fridge freezers. Let's bring in the groceries. Set that on the front porch for the milkman. That, oh, those are old. Hmm. Hmm. I right in. That's weird. I right. don't know. Hey, for almond milk, maybe that was there the way they were stacked.
it's breakfast? No, tomorrow. I can hide them for tomorrow. <laughs> the stuff I'm going to bring inside, consolidating it. This bag has lived its life.
forgetting that one night a week now, my three team football players have a team dinner, so they're not home for dinner. So that will be Wednesday night this week. What was Wednesday? Steak salad bar. Okay. I just gotta kind of like register that so I don't make as much food. But then they kind of usually come back here and eat second dinner, so I don't know. Don't need it. All right, that was fast. Look at, we're all put away. We're ready for the week. It's a good feeling. 
meats, dairy, frozen. I didn't really need to get frozen today, except those popsicles for Jordan. Dairy. Gotta get more Yo Crunch Oreos and produce. And that is it for today's shopping haul. Thank you for coming shopping with me. You are strong, you are beautiful, you are loved, you belong, and I am so proud of you. I'll see you next time.